let's find the derivative of this. So what we can do is to help see this a little bit better, we'll use u substitution. We'll set u equal to the square root of one plus cosine x. And the derivative of u is going to be, du is going to be equal to one half times the square root of one. And actually we can set this equal to one plus cosine x raised to the negative one half. Because the square root's the same thing as just whatever quantities in it raised to the one half. All right, so we'll set y equal to the square root of u or just u raised to the one half. So y prime will be equal to one half u raised to the negative one half. So we can just sub back in all these quantities. So y prime will be equal to one half. And I forgot to put du here. Um, one half. Oh, and I made another mistake. Du should be one half, and then pull out the times negative sine x. Okay, and then um, so we have negative sine x. And then quantity one plus cosine x raised to the negative one half. And this whole part out here is our du. And then finally, rearranging this nicely, we'll end up with negative sine x. We can put, of the one half, we can put the two down here. And then the one plus cosine x raised to the negative one half, we can just put this down here as a square root or just one plus cosine x raised to the one half. And that's it. All right. Hope that helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.